All right, welcome back. Let's get to our Chalk Talk, the last one of the week this week. We're so excited to announce also that our Chalk Talk segments have stretched all across the state. And just to prove how powerful an expression art is, especially when you're sheltering in place and trying to remain healthy. And we have some new submissions today to prove that point, especially our first one. This one is You Are Stars. Lisa Leatherman is the assistant principal at Bell Shivers Middle School. She created this sign for all of her scholars. And we did a little research. We found out that Bell Shivers is in North Mississippi, up in Aberdeen. And we hope that all of Mrs. Letherman's students can see all of this and all the other scholars out there because regardless of the coronavirus situation and regardless of what school you're going to, you all are stars. Then our next one is entitled Beautifully Shattered Routine 2020. And I, you know, I can identify with that. Our, my routine has been shattered this year, but it's not been all bad. Matter of fact, I've discovered some neat things about it. This uh, uh, por uh, picture's not a portrait. Uh, gosh, I hope not. I'd hate to see somebody that looked like that. Anyway, the picture was sent in by artist uh, Callie and Katie Gray. The pair is a mother-daughter daughter duo, and they're from Brandon. And then next we have No Place Like Home, because there truly is no place like home. It was signed by Dewan Hall, and it has a heart in there because we all know that home is where the heart is. And the heart of the home is the kitchen. A man would know that. And we have your favorite cartoons. It was submitted by E.R. Hill, and it does show some of your favorite cartoons like SpongeBob and the genie from Aladdin and uh, folks like that. So, and finally, one of our regular submitters brings it all home for us this week. This is a train at the Clinton train depot, drawn by Chris Shepard over in Clinton. His big brother, Z-Man, often submits artwork done by he and his sister. And again, be sure to send us snapshots of your sidewalk art to chalktalk, wjtv.com, at wjtv.com, that's an email address. And uh, make sure you include your name, where you're from, and uh, put us a title for your piece 